What's up, YouTube? Damn, call me best prize. This your girl Nesta from the 773. Man, it's early in the AM. Um, and I'm just sitting here thinking and shit. About dumb shit. I I just wanna know. Uh why do some straight males try to hit on studs? That shit be freaking me out, man. I could be riding. Pull up and it's some nigga like, damn, I'm looking at this nigga like, is you serious? Are you gay? Are you for real? You wanna, you you think there's actually a chance ever in life? <laughs> nah, I ain't tripping. I ain't ha, not yet. Just a little bit. <coughs> but um, why though? If I was a straight male. Why would you try to talk to someone who is just as masculine as you? I'll get that. They're like, I'll talk to studs. Because me being masculine and me being aggressive. Man. That shit don't work. Man. I hear studs try to holler at me too. You know, I'm not saying I'm the, the fucking, you know, the just motherfucking the finest motherfucker on the earth. But... You know, I got my moments. I clean up well, you know. Damn. But, um, getting back to the subjects. What the fuck is that shit about? Are they gay? Or do they just see it as a challenge? If you a straight male, please leave me a comment. Answer this shit to me. I don't I don't get it. What the fuck? Why? If you see me, don't try to all that bit. I ain't on that shit. Oh, uh, and all y'all I seen that pride. Hey. Right back at you, man. I had a motherfucking ball. Oh, hey, I got a new tat, y'all. If you don't know about me, yeah, I got about 23. Well, this is my 23rd tattoo today. Um, yeah, I want to see it. Check this out. symbol for uh, Scorpio. Can y'all see? It? Yeah. Motherfucker still red, still red. Tied it up. Man, some other some other things I'm gonna get, but you know, I was fiending for that tat. It's like I'm addicted. Like I'm addicted to this motherfucker too. <laughs> I went to Pride, had my little, little rainbow braid popping off, you know what I'm saying? Rainbowed out and shit. And you know what, man? Don't let the long hair fool you. You know what I'm saying? Please don't. Y'all motherfuckers that be like, you know, oh, she look feminine, whatever. I can't help it for my face and shit ain't all scarred up. You know what I'm saying? I'm tatted up. But when I get dressed, put that look you dig on and all that good shit. You know what I'm saying? It's thuggy. It is. It's thuggy. Um, not saying that I'm a thug, but I'm not, you know, very well educated. You know, um, informed, knowledgeable. I got a, I got a little sense rolling around up in me now. You know what I'm saying? Ain't nothing. Motherfuckers be letting the long hair fool you, and that ain't that ain't cute. What the fuck? I gotta wear a fade. Go back to everybody calling me Mister. Man, I had a fade. It was like, <laughs> yes, sir. How you doing, sir? Nah, man, for real. But get back at me. You know what I'm saying? If you a straight male, you listen, you watch it, this, whatever. What the fuck is it? You know what I'm saying? Oh, you you a film that they got an idea. What the fuck is it? Why do men try to hit on studs? That's all I'm asking. That's that's all I'm asking. Because the shit is, like, fucking irritating. And, man. Oh. I got into it with this chick. A little chick I've been you digging for a minute. And, uh, we got into it four, three, four o'clock in the morning, man. The day of pride. Ain't nobody got time for the shit. These motherfucking films be putting you through. I know I don't. You know what I'm saying? I'm 32. 
I planned on being married by 30. So I had to push the date back a little bit. I guess I want to be married before I be 40. I think that's some shit. I like play out with you. Got to play all these games just to beat a motherfucker. And I ain't that. I'm, I'm very blunt. You know, I tell you what I want and what I don't want. Oh, another thing I was thinking about. You know why I think some of these motherfucking niggas pull it? Because it's so many fucking studs. Still fucking niggas. Look, this is not a trend. This is a fucking lifestyle. These bitches put on some hat and some tins and think, oh, I'm stud. Bitch, it ain't that. And that's what they are. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> it's just a bitch of you, baby. It's just a bitch of you, baby. <laughs> But this ain't that. I know a motherfucker right now studded out sweat. She the hardest stud in the world. And don't nobody know if she stayed with her baby daddy. You know what I'm saying? Bitch just had a baby in the wintertime. She got pregnant in the summer. Dropped that baby in the wintertime. Summertime called her right back around. She back on the block. Ain't shit happening. And the hoes she fuck with don't even know that she dirty as hell like that. She ain't that with my nigga. I know a bitch through a bitch when I see the shit with my own fucking eyes. You dig? But, yeah. Some of y'all bitches be, man, making us fucking studs look bad. Maybe that's why niggas want to put it. You know? All these motherfuckers that don't know if they stud or feel you see them stud out in the club. Um, the next shit, you see the ass at they place of business. They fammed out around their family. I tell you, them the motherfuckers that ain't out yet and want the fucking, they want the, the gay community to think they gay. But they really not. They really not. <laughs> but, man, maybe I'm just rambling. Maybe I'm just talking shit. I'm a fucking night owl. I ain't got shit to do. My fucking video that I had for, uh, from Pride it's fucked up. So, this is me uh, in the AM uh, meditating, thinking. I really enlightening myself, you know, taking me to a higher level with them. They dig, you know. And once again, this is your girl, Nesta, from the 773. Love y'all.